How do I store dry ice safely at home? Welcome to a practical guide on how to safely store dry ice at home. We'll cover everything from initial handling to proper storage, ensuring you can use dry ice with confidence and care. It's important to remember that dry ice is not like regular ice, it's actually solid carbon dioxide, and its extremely low temperature and sublimation properties require specific storage precautions. How to handle dry ice safely? Dry ice is extremely cold, minus 78.5 degrees Celsius, or minus 109.3 degrees Fahrenheit, and can cause frostbite or cold burns if it comes into direct contact with your skin. Therefore, always use protective gear when handling dry ice. Use thick gloves or tongs to handle it and avoid touching it directly. What kind of container should I use? Choosing the right container for storing dry ice is crucial. Use an insulated container to prolong the life of the dry ice and to protect yourself and others. Styrofoam coolers are a good choice as they provide the necessary insulation while allowing the gas to vent. Avoid using glass containers or airtight containers. Glass can shatter due to the extreme cold of the dry ice, and airtight containers can explode due to the buildup of carbon dioxide gas as the dry ice sublimates. Where should I store dry ice? Choose a well-ventilated area in your home to store the dry ice. As dry ice sublimates, it turns into carbon dioxide gas. If the gas builds up in an unventilated area, it can displace oxygen and create a suffocation risk. Never store dry ice in your refrigerator or freezer. The extremely cold temperature can cause your appliance's thermostat to shut off. How long can I store dry ice? Despite your best efforts, dry ice doesn't have a long shelf life. Even in an insulated container, it sublimates at a rate of 5 to 10 pounds every 24 hours. Therefore, it's best to purchase dry ice close to the time you intend to use it. Dry ice is a unique substance that can be extremely useful, but it requires special handling and storage. By using protective gear, choosing the right container, storing it in a well-ventilated area, and timing your purchase correctly, you can safely and effectively use dry ice at home. We hope this guide has been helpful, ensuring your experience with dry ice is a safe one.